Welcome back on this Wednesday afternoon, early evening, and uh, we have a mostly clear sky. Now there are some clouds. You take a look at the uh, satellite picture, which includes the clouds and the radar. We combine them so you can see where the clouds are and also where there is rain falling. So here come some clouds out of the western portion of Illinois and some rain down the far south part of Missouri. Eventually, we have the possibility of a, at least a little bit of rain scattered across the uh, News 10 viewing area. It's not going to be a big deal. It's not going to be a complete washout or anything like that. But frankly, my pansies could use a little drink. And uh, so that'll be nice. And we'll uh, get the flowers watered a little bit and then uh, hopefully be able to move on into a nice Friday and Saturday. Right now it is 66 degrees, Linton 66, Vincent 68, look at that, it's hit 70 in Olney, Flora 70, Effingham 70, and Casey 70, which by the way is right just at average for this time of year. So finally we get a day that's just about average temperature wise, but here you can see how the clouds are now beginning to move in and they'll continue to do so. So let's take a look at the Storm Team 10 Futurecast. This picks it up at 1 a.m. during the overnight hours. And uh, we can see now how some uh, rain is starting to move in over here in Effingham County and into Jasper County, up just north of Edgar County. And so a little bit of rain over here in Illinois as a cold front. Actually, it's a cool front. It's not sharply colder behind this, but a little bit colder. So this front comes in and brings along with it a little bit of rain. This is 2 a.m., so the possibility of some scattered showers as we get into the overnight hours. And then into the day tomorrow, not a tremendous chance of rain. I'm going to keep some rain in the forecast. I was talking with meteorologist Lindsay Monroe about this a little earlier this afternoon. We both decided that it probably would be wise just to put the, still the possibility of rain in the forecast at least for a portion of the day tomorrow. We'll call it isolated and then that'll move out of here and then by tomorrow night the sky becomes partly cloudy and things shape up to be pretty nice till we get into the weekend. Saturday's nice. Saturday will have very nice very pleasant conditions, but by Saturday night into Sunday, we have a warm front lifting up and then it's going to stall out. That could keep us in a day to day chance of rain. So becoming cloudy, a slight chance of rain overnight, about 45 for the overnight low. Isolated showers, breezy and cool tomorrow, high of 60. And then for it was 66 today so far. Uh, partly cloudy, turning colder tomorrow night down to 39 degrees. And the seven day forecast Friday, more sunshine, a high of around 69. Saturday, I'm sorry, yeah, Saturday 73. I kind of got ahead of myself. Saturday 73 and a gentle breeze, but by Saturday night, more clouds, maybe a chance of rain. And then that warm front comes in, so that keeps us warm, but it stalls out just to the north of us.